On this hand, Avigdor Lieberman, the head of the secular nationalist Yisrael Betenu party. On the other hand, the ultra-Orthodox or Haredi parties. And in the middle, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu. Lieberman and the ultra-Orthodox have been at each other's throats for years on matters of religion and state, and now Lieberman is drawing a line in the sand. An effort to draft more ultra-Orthodox yeshiva students into the army has been thwarted for years by the Haredim, but Lieberman says the bill he drew up last year to do just that either gets a guaranteed passage without a single comma changed, or he's not joining the governing coalition, leaving Netanyahu short of a parliamentary majority and sending Israel right back to elections. The ultra-Orthodox say they've compromised by agreeing to increase quotas, but they want the implementation in the hands of the government rather than written into law. Lieberman says such an arrangement is worthless and would only lead to another capitulation to the ultra-Orthodox, something he's no longer willing to stomach, even if it means sending Israel back to elections and putting his own political career on the line.